enjoying having you guys do the driving. As in me. I would drive. I don't trust your driving. That's the thing. I wouldn't be able to relax because I'm reading. I'm TikToking. I'm doing work. I'm literally getting so much more done now that we've come around to this driving arrangement. It's springtime in Alaska, although you wouldn't know it looking around. We've had tons of ice. We've had huge blizzards. We still have a ton of snow on the ground. And I love it. I mean, seeing the snowy landscape makes me really happy. So we're going to a pig farm today, guys. Isn't it a rescue? Yeah, a rescue. This lady is like a legend in terms of being able to flip pigs so you don't need anesthesia to do their feet. What? Flip them? Yeah, like when you tip a sheep. That sounds ridiculous. <laughs> no, that that's that's a for real thing. I've done that. Pigs are kind of the devil to work with. No offense to the devil. <laughs> uh. Come here, Brody. You want some? We are Alaska Potbelly Pig Rescue. Come on, babies. Yeah. These pigs are everything to me. I mean, I eat, sleep, and breathe. I shouldn't say that. Don't don't put that on there. I don't okay, eat pigs. <laughs> Babies, come and eat. Pigs are like people. They're so intelligent. Everybody's got a different personality. Once you kiss a snout, you'll never go back. OMG, look at that porker. Hi. Oh my god, so nice look to at meet all these guys. friends. <laughs> so cute. Okay, this is not a pig. Correct. Okay. Hi. <laughs> How many pigs do you have here? I think we have 51 at the moment. You know, springtime is here now, so we'll be seeing pigs dropped off on our doorstep, so we'll be trying to scramble to get them adopted out and, and clean up on aisle one. Uh-oh. Pig poop. We dump about 800 pounds of pig poo a week. Ooh. Oh, my god. Yeah. Well, let's get started. All right. <laughs> Peekaboo. Hello. All of these are heated. <laughs> There's pigs coming in and out of little piggy houses. They've got piggy doors. Hello, beautiful. I love you. And it's really just wonderful to see how happy these pigs are. Oh, my gosh. You're like a show pig. That's yeah, Winston. He's actually the one we're going to flip today. Oh, OK. So Sheila's got Winston out here as like our example pig, our guinea pig sort of thing. But he's going to be flipped, and then we're going to trim his feet. Come on, Winston. You're going to push your face to where I want you to he go. got a short face. We have never heard of this before, but we heard that it just, it's a game changer. And I'm so excited to learn it. Oh. Oh. <laughs> All right. There he goes. Whenever we have to do any sort of trimming of feet with pigs, we have to anesthetize them, which not only <laughs> is hard and takes longer for us, but it's also very dangerous for the animal because pig anesthesia is very touch and go. Are you kidding me? It's so bougie, right? This is where I can come and hang out with them and watch yeah. TV in a home-like setting, so. I love it. Okie dokie. I'm ready for pig flipping. We can only do this once, so okay. you're gonna come on this side with okay. me. Okay. Come on, Winston. Pigs are not easy to handle. Sedating them is a huge ordeal. And so I learned how to flip a pig. If you have them on their back, you can do a little more things with them. Basically, the second he's up, you're yes. going to go for the hind leg. Yes. You're going to grab and roll oh. over. We're going to pull him out from uh, under. Together, like a one, two, three thing, or just? Yes. Okay. <laughs> we definitely want to do this together <laughs> so we're not twisting and turning. Winston is a big, stout dude. He definitely has some tusks, so I'm a little nervous. We don't want to oh, damage him. Oh, lordy. So, I know a lot of vets who have scars from working on potbelly pigs that come in the clinic. I've got the One, far leg. One, two, three. Oh, that worked. That's it. Now jump oh, on top oh, of them. Oh, OK. Oh, god. No, no, not like that. Like, okay. stand up. OK. Stand up. <laughs> stand up and straddle him. So you oh, can stand like up. with my butt in your face? Yep, yeah, yeah. OK. No, no, no. Like, no. turn this way. <laughs> turn this way. OK, I got him. I got him. OK, and just stand up. Oh, oh you don't have to sit on him. him. <laughs> right in the pig. I thought, like, flip the pig was, like, just the name of the technique, but that's what we're doing, literally flipping a pig. <laughs> we're counting down, like kind of one, two, and then suddenly it's like we've got him flipped. <laughs> it was fast. Oh, baby, it's OK. Winston looks stunned. He's on his back. He's a bit nervous. I can see he's got a little bit of a shake, but he is not trying to move. So you don't have to hold his legs. Okay. Just go ahead and stand up. 
all four of his little piggies are up in the air. He's just kind of laying there, like, mesmerized. That's a big I difference. really can't believe this. I, I'm like, <laughs> this there you go. such a game changer. I can't even. Right? Yes. He's not fighting us at all. He's not squealing at all. I'm like, that's all there is to it? I could have been doing this for 20 years. Beautiful. This is like insane. It's so much better than I love it. sedating. As a vet, I am constantly learning. I work on pretty much every species that we, you know, we have here in Alaska. So, you know, I can't know it all. It's okay, Chunky. Sometimes that's the fun of what I'm doing is learning. It just makes my day so much more fun. Yep, and that's all there is to Yay! it. Yay! Way to go, Winston! Come on, man. That was amazing. <laughs> I was so impressed. I'm so <laughs> impressed. I can't wait to go flip all the pigs. Any pig I see, I'm gonna start flipping from now on. <laughs> I'm really hopeful that she uses that information and can um, help the pigs that she sees because they're just my heart and soul and I love them very much.